Okay, now in the Harvey Norman Lounge, Trudy Brewer joins us to share some of her favourite new trends and products that are hitting makeup counters for spring. Morning. Good morning. So what are the new spring makeup trends? It's spring. I'm so excited about that. Look, there's so many, but the thing that I wanted to say first up is that the products that you're going to use this spring are so clever and far more innovative than I've ever seen. Really? Um, I guess the first one is skin. I mean, there is just this whole raft of illuminators and brighteners and um, glow-enhancing yeah, products. Yeah, that's what that, we want. We want that glowing exactly. skin. Exactly. And you know what they do? They create the most beautiful-looking skin, even if you don't have it. Really? So with some Genius. tips and tricks, um, you can actually learn how to do that. And there's some inspiration from Instagram here. Um, now, obviously, these girls are very young. But yeah, that's a not lot going to work on me, honey. No, well, actually it would. That's the thing. I could do that on you. Really? With some of the um, highlighters and the um, primers that I've bought I feel it's going to sink into the, the wrinkles, though. No, it doesn't. That's the thing. It's such amazing technology. It doesn't. It's just strategically placed skincare and primers um, and foundations and concealers that actually give you this gorgeous lit from within. Wow. Look, so what skin. are some of the things that you bought? So I guess the first up is a primer. Now, there is a real trend towards being a little bit lighter with your foundation doubling up on your concealer and adding an illuminating primer. So um, the first up is this gorgeous little um, Dare to Bear Elizabeth Arden oil and it's got some gold mica suspended in the oil. So that can go anywhere, just placed on the cheek, mm. on the decollete, on the arms, on the I've legs. used this all over my body actually. It's beautiful and you can. And the thing is, what's happening with makeup is they're using skincare technology in makeup to make it good for your skin as good. well. Um, another um, great Smashbox um, Radiance Primer, that is absolutely beautiful. Or you can mix that in with your foundation just to make it a little bit more dewy and glowing. Or you can use it alone and just put a little bit of concealer over the top. Um, I've got to mention the Instant Full Coverage um, Concealer from Bobbi Brown, blended with an eye cream that just wipes out all of the fatigue under the eye area. Wow, that sounds like magic juice. And yeah. it is quite tacky yeah. and it actually sits, it sits on the skin. Once you prep the skin with an eye cream, it just looks amazing. Um, and also clever little um, bronzing sticks now that you can just add to wherever you feel you need a little bit of bronze. I'm gonna have this all over my um, yeah, and that, oh, that's, that's nice. it's very lightweight. That's another Smashbox product. That can go anywhere, just like above so the cheekbones. Rub it in a little um, bit on the brow bone is really nice place to highlight okay. a little bit of bronze. Nice. Um, and clever technology in brushes. Now this is a Simply Essential brush. Big, huge, fluffy, dense brush. You pop on your primer, your concealer, and a little bit of foundation, and you blend it all together with oh, that lovely nice. brush. this is nice. I know. It's so really smooth. Clever. So you can buff all that makeup together to get this really gorgeous, seamless look to your That's foundation. That's what the makeup professionals do, isn't it? But you can be a makeup professional at home. Good. I need yeah. all the help I can get. Excellent. Let's talk um, about um, So let's talk eyes. about eyes, mm. too. At the moment, there's a real trend towards some really beautiful poppy spring shades, like soft greens and peaches. Um, this paper light... Um, um, cream shadow from Shiseido launches this week. It's got Hydro Wrap technology, so it sticks to the eyes and highlights and moisturises. Oh, that's a nice colour too. So sheer. Um, we've talked about these Ooh, before, and I think you've got this goldy shade. Oh, is that the Revlon one? This is the Revlon yes. cream shadow, $18. At your pharmacy. This stuff stays on too, I love it. Or at Farmers, you know, amazing. It just sticks and stays on 12 hour wear. Um, clever, clever liner. Liquid liner is also really hot right now. I'm very bad with this. This little brush is inspired by calligraphy, Japanese, very clever. So you can actually just guide your hand to getting the perfect line. Wow, is that, is that like idiot proof? Because it's I idiot usually proof. look like a child's drawn line on a No, no, no. Now. I've got a tip for that. Anchor your arm on a table. And so that when you're putting on your liner, you've got some stability. So always anchor your arm, and then you can just draw the Fabulous. most perfect line. And this is so clever from Mac. Who would have thought of it? It's sort of um, inspired by a uh, pizza wheel. It's called Roller Wheel Liner. Roll it on my hand. And it literally rolls oh. the perfect oh. line. That is awesome. So again, you know... Can you do it one more time? I'll, I'll do it one more time. Yep. So just again, anchor your thumb oh, and it so just good. rolls the perfect line. Right, Once it move... dries, it doesn't budge. We better move on to lips quickly before we run lips out of time. Quickly. There's two innovations that I'm seeing for lips. Um, a liquid lipstick. Now, it's slightly more matte than a normal lipstick, but again, it's inspired to actually stick it on there. Stick it on there. And stay put, um, that's Urban Decay. This one, Bare Essentials, I'm a real fan. This is actually um, very, very matte, a nice matte red. Great if you've got fine lines around the uh, around the lips and you want it to stay. Yes. And the last clever innovation is lip oil instead of gloss. 
Wow. So oil, fruit oils inspired into a lip gloss that gives a beautiful shiny stain. Oh, these so are you nice. So yeah, you can choose. You can have a glossy lip with an oil or go for a more lasting lip um, a more lasting lipstick in a liquid form. I've tried that one as well. It's really nice. feels really nice and luscious yeah. on your lips. Well, haven't you got a load of goodies that you've oh, brought in today? Totally. And they're all hitting counters around now. So September's the time to shop for beauty. It's great. It's always playtime when you come in. Uh, thank you so much, thank Trudy. You now. For more of Trudy's top tips, you can head to her website, beautyeq.co.nz.